Hey guys, Erin here with another episode of A Little Bit of Everything with Erin. Today we'll be doing a quick tutorial in our Silhouette Cameo. I had a couple of questions from some people that downloaded this file from my group and asked where I got these flowers. I actually made that myself, so I thought we could do a quick tutorial today on how to do something like that. So I've zoomed into my page so it's easier for you to see. I am going to select my circle tool, and I'm not going to hold the shift key because I don't want my circles to be even. And I like to do about 10, and there's no right or wrong way, you just kind of make them. And then I will highlight all of them and I will go over to the right hand side to the transform panel. I will do my horizontal center and then my vertical center. And now I have them all even. I'm actually gonna go in a little closer for you guys. I do wanna make this one a smidge bigger. So the next thing that I like to do is you could stop here and finish it out, but I like to transform it a little more. So I will take the first circle and I'll double click on that to get my edit points and I just I just play with them just kind of move them around and again no right or wrong way to do this So once you're happy with that, you just want to highlight all of the circles, right click that and make a compound path. To make sure it's correct, you'll just fill it in with color and that's how it would look. If you wanted to add a background, you would just highlight this and you would go over to your star on the right, that's your offset panel, and just do an offset of that. What I like to do is take out the innards of that offset by right clicking it and hitting release compound path and deleting those middle pieces. We don't need those. Then you could take another color, we'll say black, and just put that behind it. And that way you would layer it right on top. And that's how you would get like an artistic flower or rose doing it yourself and designing it the way that you want. So I hope that helps. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button. And if you want to share it, that always helps me out and I appreciate it. If you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button and join us. And if you hit the bell at the top of the page, you'll get notifications anytime I post new videos. If you have suggestions for other videos I should be making, you can leave me a comment about that below too. I always appreciate your feedback. Until next time, guys, happy crafting!